Bro, they've been showing this girl as if she's been murdered, raped, and butchered by the resistant group. And then two days later, her mom comes out and says, Oh, she's not dead actually, she's being treated. And not only that, she's being treated in a hospital in Gaza. You guys kept talking about 40 babies being murdered, and you can't even cite the source. Because it's completely made up, it's all lies. You're trying to make up a narrative, and you can justify your actions. Let me remind you that you guys are the one who killed babies. You guys are the one who kill women. We have footage, endless footage, of people being taken out of rubble, out of their homes that they've been living for years. And you guys justify it by fake news. So who's the oppressed here? Is it the civilians who are getting killed and murdered every day? Or is it you guys who make up false news to justify your actions and celebrate it? That's what I want to know. Imagine spreading lies for days and days, riling all these people up and then be like, oops, my bad. It was not true. Really? After two days? After justifying the whole war and the bombs and the missiles and the illegal war crimes that's been going on? Oops, my bad. Now imagine if it was the other way around. What would you guys do? If this is 